Kennard has been serving Southern California for over 35 years and specialise in sculptured cakes to painted cakes, wedding cakes to pub cakes. Oh, one of the famous cake shops in West Hollywood is Cake and Art. Some fabulous cakes here and also they have the world famous Cupcakes. Now, I have a dog called Molly at home. Molly. And Molly is a miniature schnauzer and is very spoiled and said to me, Dad, I want some cupcakes or pupcakes brought back to, to my house so I can eat them. So here I am, we're going to make some pupcakes together. Cody, show us how it's done. Well, I hope Molly's sent you first class, first of all. O always, always first so, class. So, what I'm going to show you, first of all, um, the pupcakes, mm. they're made, they're all natural, mm -hmm. made with whole wheat flour, soy flour, um, real carrots, shredded carrots, mm -hmm. um, eggs, and molasses. Mm. And you can see like the whole carrot in there, so it's really healthy for them as well as really um, good for them. Mm. You know, a lot of protein Oof. in there. So I'm going to show you how to make the frosting. Okay. Right? So I need about a cup of the cream cheese. Okay. You can cut that for me while I put this together. Okay. And the best part, the dogs really love the frosting because it's got peanut butter in it and cream cheese. I'm gonna yes. put it in here. In there, okay. This is complicated for me because I'm a mere mortal. And now I'm gonna need about um, a third of a cup of peanut butter. So put that into there. Put it right in there with the cream cheese. You cannot use chocolate, obviously, no, in dog it treats. Kills it. Um, but they have a thing called carob, which mm. is like chocolate, which is safe for dogs. So if you want to do it with like a, a carob chip in mm -hmm. it, you can also do that too. Here we go. We have about a half a cup of honey that goes in next. Mm -hmm. Flip the switch. Perfect. Whoa, so, that's fantastic. Now. I'm like an astronaut. Since we're on television, we're going to speed it up a little bit. What, you like to talk faster? If you want a creamy consistency where you can actually put it into a piping bag and pipe it out, which I'm going to show you how to do that. So how long do you do this for? Maybe like a minute or less. But it's fantastic. So basically, when it comes out, it's going to be like that, OK? Yep. Now, you take your spatula and your bag, <laughs> your piping bag, Whoa. and you, get, you fold it under like that so that you can put everything in and you're going to close it up. Because my doctor had one of these. Mm. <laughs> oh, no. So put that into that. Scoot. That's it. Yeah, like a little that. bit more. Have you ever iced anything before? Uh, not legally, no. Let <laughs> me mm -hmm. do the first one for you, all right? And you're just going to squeeze with your palm and lead with that. So I squeeze my paw. Okay. Squeeze, with, squeeze with your paw, right? Whoa, look at that. There you go. I do one every 10 minutes. <laughs> Okay, yeah, you're not hired. Look at that. But it's beautiful. Take your fingers and put a little on there. Look at that. Gorgeous. Molly would be very, very happy with me. We will send these home to Molly. Um, this is one of our products that we do ship overseas. It's a personalized dog treat tin. Uh, you send us your dog's photo and their name, and mm -hmm. we put it together in a little tin. And whatever, we do barbecue treats, we do uh, peanut butter yogurt treats, and those can all be shipped Fantastic. across the pond, as I say.